Welcome to Grand Drive. This is a Nissan test track in Japan and we've come here to look at some advanced technology, the kind of things that could be in the next car that you buy. Now, one of the devices is fitted to this car. This is no ordinary Nissan Leaf. Now your eyes didn't deceive you, the car actually steered itself to avoid knocking over that pedestrian. So let's find out how that worked. Yoji Seto is from the Intelligent Transportation Systems Development Department. What's actually happening in this car? で、それと同時にですね、相手いるゾーンをエスケープゾーンを検知して、あの、ステアリングが自動的に切って、あの、衝突を回避していきました。It's not just about making cars safer, but improving driving pleasure too. This is the Infinity G37S and it's being used to test something pretty special too. Now the challenge for engineers has long been how to get the right kind of direct feel in the steering. So the driver really feels involved with hustling the car along. Now in most cars, if you go over bumps like these manholes here, you get a lot of judder in the steering wheel. But not this one. In this car, the steering is electronic. There's no mechanical link most of the time between the steering wheel and the wheel, so even if you go over really quite big bumps like this, these are ruts in the road, there's no judder at all. It's quite hard to see, but I can tell you it feels pretty extraordinary driving it. It's not like driving a video game though. I'm changing lanes pretty aggressively here. And you can really feel the road, the steering, is very direct and this technology, this next generation steering, could be available as early as next year.